Other news now, students are returning to the classroom this week. Some of them will be wearing masks again. Yeah, the CDC's new mask guidance comes as the fall semester is just getting underway for some students. Some school officials across Indiana are considering new recommendations or requirements. CBS 4 Statehouse reporter Kristen Escout joins us now with reaction. Kristen. Well, Debbie and Bob, so far the state hasn't announced any new recommendations for schools. That means it's entirely up to each district to decide whether they'll require masks or set any other safety protocols. Parents and school leaders are trying to keep up with the changing COVID guidance from officials. A little confusing, but you know, you just stay on top of it and uh, listen what's going on. And Interestingly enough, this is the third time we've changed in the last two weeks. Wayne Township Superintendent Jeff Butts says hours after the CDC announcement and the night before school started, he recommended fully vaccinated teachers and students wear a mask. It was already required for those who have not been vaccinated. He says so far, most people are taking the CDC's advice. In the elementary schools that I visited, uh, I would estimate somewhere around 90% of our staff had them on. Of course, 100% of our children had them on. Uh, in the junior highs that I went to, uh, I was probably closer to 80% of our staff. I would recommend taking every safe step possible, imaginable, doable uh, to keep the kiddos in school. Governor Eric Holcomb told me this week he doesn't want to see students face any additional learning loss this school year. There are steps that schools can take. Many are. Uh, as they go back, they've stated about distancing, about masking. Now, the Indiana Department of Health says it is still reviewing the CDC's new guidance. The Indiana State Teachers Association is urging school districts across Indiana to follow the CDC's new guidelines. Kristen Eskow, CBS 4 News.